What's up, everyone? Um, I know that my last stream was kind of a downer, but <clears throat> that's because of what's going on. And it's because I genuinely feel bad that I'm not able to give you guys the music that you want. And a lot of you guys are like always, and I noticed a lot of people in the last live stream were like, hey, like, explain what's going on. Okay, so now that I don't have a bunch of people <clears throat> going all over the place and having to, <clears throat> having to answer a billion questions, um, allow me to elaborate on what N-Word Boy and William Glory Hole have done. They've essentially created a fake name by the name of Wes Chilkins by taking my first and last name and changing the letters. Because my real name is Chance Wilkins. But people, like, he would, you know, he took, well, they took the letters in my name, switched them to make the fake name Wance Chilkins. So that's how the name came about for them. Now, you're probably sitting there wondering, well, how do they steal your music if they have the copyright? So that's easy. It doesn't matter where I post my music. When I first, when they started, when they first started stealing my music, what they did was they started with my hit single, Street Racing Scene, which was going to be a part of an album that I was going to work on to pay homage to the car culture that I grew up around and that I've been so blessed to have so many friends through and stuff like that, and that I've had the honor of becoming part of. But what he does is every time I go to release a brand new song, he will take that song and get it coffee written under the Wanch Chilkins name. Because he does not want me making money. And that's why he's doing it. That's why it's so hard for me to make any money. I, mean, I can't get a regular job because of these people. Because of the rumors that they've spread. So, I mean, it's been very difficult for me. But like I said, when it comes to my music the, and my merchandise, the reason why I'm not able to release any music, like I said, because William Glory Hole and N-Word Boy will steal it and get it copywritten under their name, which is fake. But as for the merchandise, the reason why I'm not able to release any merchandise at all at this point in time isn't because I don't want to. It's literally because of the fact that whenever I go to release any kind of merchandise and they find the shop, they will mass report it. Because, see, their ultimate goal is to make me homeless. When my mom passes away, they do not want me to have any money. Or any way to make any kind of income. So they attack me in any way that they can. Which is why they're doing what they're doing. Because they do not want me making money. They, their ultimate goal is... To see me homeless and on the streets. And you're probably thinking, well, why is that? Because a lot of these trolls that are following under him, they genuinely want to see me dead. Like, they genuinely want to kill me. Which is what their end goal is. Is once my mom passes away, they want to see me homeless and on the streets. And for someone to come along on some random day and end up murdering me. That's what they want. And it's not fair. It's not right. Because I can't get a regular job because they've already spread too many rumors. 
and doing this YouTube thing and being a streamer and being a musician, it's all I got left. I, I If I don't make it at this, I have nothing else. I genuinely have nothing else if I can't make a shot at this. That's why I'm always putting in so much time and so much effort. That's why I'm constantly busting my ass on three, four, five, six streams a day. Just really fighting and battling to get to where I want to be and where I need to be. Because right now my future depends on it. I have nothing else. I don't have the luxury of getting a regular job like everyone else. Due to the, the false rumors and the accusations that were spread about me. So I literally have no choice but to be successful at this. Which is why I'm always fighting and calling people out on their shit. Like William and N-Word Boy. Who go around... Stealing my shit and spreading lies about me and doing this and doing that. It's not that I want to. It's that I have to do that. I have to call these people out. Because that's the only way to expose them for what they're doing. There is no other way to expose them. I've tried every other way. But calling them out. Is what gets them going. That's what gets them scared. And not only that. But. It allows me. It allows me to bring attention to what they're doing because I want as many people as possible to see these videos of me speaking out against what they're doing because what these people are doing is very 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 highly illegal it really is Which is why I'm always speaking out on it. That's why I'm constantly speaking out against what these people are doing. Because like I said. I'm not calling these people out because I want to. No. I don't want to do that. But if I want a shot at getting my life back and making myself successful... I have to do this. I have to call them out. I have to speak out against what they're doing. Otherwise, no one is going to take notice and put a stop or try to put a stop to it. So everything I am doing by calling them out isn't because I want to. It's because I have to. And I hate it. I absolutely hate that I'm having to do that. Because like I told y'all earlier in the last live stream. When these trolls do what they do. They're not just robbing me. They're robbing you guys. My fans. My audience. My community of people. They are literally robbing you guys. Of you guys wanting me to be successful. They're robbing you guys of music that you guys want to hear. They are robbing you guys of merchandise that I've worked fucking hard as hell on to bring to you guys. They are robbing you of all that. And if, and if you ask me, this this brand, the Ghost Eye Sniper brand, isn't just my brand. This is your guys' brand too. We're all a community. So to be honest, y'all should be just as pissed off as I am. Because like I said, this brand, the Ghost Eye Sniper brand, isn't just me, 
coming on here and doing cover shows, doing DJ sessions, doing gameplay videos. No. This is a, literally a community of people that you guys have helped to build. This brand is just as much as uh, just as much your guys as it is mine. The brand isn't just me. It's all of us. Cuz like I said this brand isn't just my brand. It's your guys's brand too. The fans, the real fans, the hardcore motherfuckers that are in every stream watching these videos. It's just as much of your guys' brand as it is mine. But as the leader of it, you know, I want to be able to put out the best content and the best music that I can for you guys. But how am I supposed to do that when I'm being robbed? I mean, I'm literally being robbed blind by N-Word Boy and William Glory Hole. All because they don't want to see me succeed. And at the end of the day, their ultimate goal is to see me homeless and dead on the streets when my mom passes away. That's their ultimate goal. They want to see me dead on the streets. So I have no choice but to make it. I don't have any other options left. My All the options I did have ran out a long time ago. A very long time ago. So like I said, me doing music and being a streamer, this is all I got. I have no choice but to make this work. And I mean no choice but to make this work. Which is why I work so hard. Sleepless nights. Sometimes two days with no sleep. Sometimes three. Because I want to bring you guys the best content that I can possibly bring you guys. I want to be able to start releasing music again. I want to start running my own merchandise shop again. I want to bring you guys that. Which is why I need y'all's help. We need to get this out there. We need to push this to the point where it cannot be ignored. Because I'll be honest, I'm tired of being taken advantage of by these guys. I'm tired of being walked on and stolen from. Because what they're doing is clearly illegal. What they're doing is very illegal and it's not okay. Mass reporting my channels for ban evading garbage. Um, filing false counter, filing counterclaims with falsified information. <clears throat> Copyright infringement of intellectual property. Like. There's just so much that goes into it. But like I said, man. I need y'all, man. My community of people. My followers. My fans. I need y'all's help. I need y'all's help to shut these guys down. Once and for all. So that I can get my life back. 
and do what I love again. The things that I used to do. I need y'all's help to shut down these terrorists so that I can get my life back. But now you guys know the truth about why I'm not, why I've not been able to release any music or any merchandise in a very long time. It's not because I don't want to. It's because these people are keeping me from doing those things. And again, guys, I am sorry that they're doing this. I'm sorry that they're doing this to you guys. Y'all deserve to be able to buy my merch if you want. Or buy my music if you want. Without them getting in the way. Y'all definitely deserve that. But with that being said, man. Hopefully you guys have a better understanding of the situation. And now with that being said. I'll catch y'all later. Peace.